This is your primetime forecast for East Alabama and West Georgia from Dr. Don's Weather. Dr. Don's Weather is made possible by the Randolph County Commission, Heron's Tree Service, Roger Bell Auto Brokers, Southern Auction Solutions, Genesis Weight Clinic, Jimmy Stevens Construction, Anchor Roofing, the Town of Wadley, Auction 431 South, and Bama Diesel Repair. From the Alpha Weather Center, powered by Boondocks Barbecue and Creamery, Southern Union State Community College, and the venue at Five Points Farms. Here's Dr. Don. Good morning, East Alabama and West Georgia. Welcome to your Monday, and let me say thank you to First Light Coffee in downtown Roanoke. Those folks are uh, awfully kind. They were uh, able to hook me up with some delicious coffee Saturday morning in downtown Roanoke, and I invite you to stop by and tell them Dr. Don sent you. It's First Light Coffee there in downtown Roanoke. Uh, very easy to find. Uh, and stop by and taste their coffee. Now, they roast their coffee there uh, at First Light Coffee. It's delicious. I was able to spend some time with the owners on Saturday. I'm, this is kind of one of my hobbies. Uh, I am nowhere near as good as these folks. They know what they're doing. Uh, but they were able to give me some of their uh delicious bold coffee and uh, i'm as a matter of fact i'm drinking a cup of it right now it's good stuff stop by and see them on main street in downtown roanoke first light coffee we hope to have first light coffee on with us as a partner coming up real soon here on dr don's weather mm, good stuff all right also be sure you get in touch with jamie dukas jamie can handle your insurance needs doesn't matter if it's personal or commercial if it's alabama or if it's georgia jamie has got you covered you can save money with alpha insurance and that's very important in this economy so get in touch with jamie today by scanning the qr code on the screen click the link at the top of the video or call jamie at 256-831-7770 jamie dukas for all of your insurance needs we have major weather changes on the way but first let me remind you to subscribe to Dr. Don's Weather Channel over on the YouTube and click that little bell so that you get that notification when we go live to cover severe weather. We're not looking for any thunderstorm activity today, uh, tomorrow, or even into midweek. Uh, there's Tuesday, maybe some showers and thunderstorms up there around the Great Lakes. And then there's the Wednesday with no thunderstorm forecast across southeastern United States. But what we are looking at is a major, major weather change on the way as we get into uh, the, uh, well, next 24 to 48 hours. I'll give you all that information when we take a look at your six-day forecast. But first, we have a couple of, uh, couple of disturbed areas of active weather out in the tropics, but neither of them are going to affect us here across uh, East Alabama or West Georgia. We have that one area near... Uh, the Bahamas down there that's going to develop, we think it's got about a 40% chance of developing, but it's going to turn off to the north. That has been the MO this year. And then we have another area that has about a 40 to a 60% chance of developing down in the Caribbean, but that's going to move west towards Central America. That's not going to be a problem for us here across the southeastern United States as well. So let's go ahead and take a look at your current conditions at the venue at Five Points Farms in Five Points, Alabama. 60 degrees currently under clear skies. Wind out of the southwest at 1, gusting to 2. Humidity is 94%. The barometric pressure at 30.03. 59 degree dew point. No rain the past 24 hours. 81 was your high yesterday. I hope that you enjoyed that because... That's the last time you're going to see 81 for a minute. Sunrise this morning at 6.55, and the sun sets this evening at 5.54 p.m. And our major weather changes will be underway by the time we get to sunset this evening. We are headed for 79 this afternoon in Roanoke, but that's going to be shortly after noon, and then the temperature will be falling this afternoon. 73 in Ashland, 74 in Lineville, 76 over in Wadawi, 
75 up in Ranburn. We'll make it to 78 in Dadeville and Valley Tops out this afternoon at 81 degrees. All right, there it is, the six-day forecast from the Alpha Weather Center. Jamie Dukas, your local Alpha agent. Mostly sunny today, though clouds will start to stream in late in the afternoon and will give you a 20% chance of a shower or two this evening. Now, this is going to be a major cold front that's going to move through Alabama and Georgia, but it is moisture starved. There's just not much precipitation with this front. The big story here, I mean, no question about it, is going to be the cold temperatures and the brisk northwest wind. Uh, down to 48 tonight with a passing shower from time to time. And then as we get into Halloween Tuesday, it'll be a mostly sunny day. Winds are going to start to pick up out of the northwest. And uh, we're looking at a high temperature on your Halloween of only 59 degrees. You factor in that northwest wind, it's going to feel like it's in the 40s pretty much all day long tomorrow. And then as we head toward trick-or-treat time on Tuesday evening, right at sunset with that northwest wind, uh, wind chill factors for trick-or-treaters tomorrow night could be down into the mid-20s. That's what it's going to feel like. Now, the overnight temperature, the overnight low is going to be 32 but you factor in that northwest wind because, see, we have a secondary cold front that will come in here Tuesday night to reinforce that cold air, and that's going to bring more wind with it. So uh, not going to be a very pleasant Halloween trick-or-treat night for the kids across East Alabama and West Georgia. Then on Wednesday, we start the day. It's going to be sunny and cold. We start the day with frost. Uh, good chance. I mean, we have a freeze watch that's going to be in effect Tuesday night into Wednesday, so there's a very, very good opportunity here for widespread frost as you wake up on Wednesday morning. A high temperature on Wednesday, uh, 55 degrees, and we're probably going to see that freeze watch or warning extended into Thursday morning. As you get up Thursday morning, it's going to be frosty again. 61 will be the high on Thursday down to 35 for your overnight low on Thursday night. Then that slow warming trend starts on Friday. You know how it works. So this is what we do in the fall and winter months here in the southeast. We get cold for a couple of days, and then we slowly warm back up. On Friday, we'll make it to 66. We'll stay above freezing on Friday night for high school football. And then on Saturday, sunny and much warmer, 71 will be the high on Saturday. Looks like a perfect weekend on the way for East Alabama and West Georgia. Let's take a look at your Southern Union State Community College live Doppler HD radar. You can see what's coming at us. That's cold front draped across extreme northwest Alabama, extending down into Louisiana. Uh, and this will slowly move off to the east southeast today. And you'll see those showers move in behind it. But there's a lot more precipitation out there right now than there will be when it makes it in here this afternoon and tonight. Uh, we're going to start to see these showers uh, just evaporate as they get into Alabama and Georgia. I'm not looking for much rainfall at all. Uh, and there's your tropical system down around the Bahamas. Uh, again, expected to turn back off to the north and eventually to the northeast. Hey, don't forget to follow us over on Twitter. It's at DSTREN 1040. We broadcast all of our weather information on Twitter, just as we do on Facebook, YouTube, and at drdonwx.com. That's our home on the World Wide Web. And don't forget, text the word ALERT to 265-540-8664 if you live in Randolph County. That's hyperreach. That will allow you to get that important information from the Randolph County Emergency Management Brought to you by Randolph County Commission. If you own a business, if you're part of a civic organization, county, or municipal government, and you'd like to be a partner with us here on Dr. Don's Weather, such as Boondocks Barbecue and Creamery up there on beautiful Lake Weedowie, all you have to do is send me a message on Messenger, and I can have you started by the time we do our very next weather forecast, which, if the good Lord's willing and the creek don't rise, will happen first thing tomorrow morning here on Dr. Don's Weather. This has been your primetime forecast for East Alabama and West Georgia from the Alpha Weather Center. 
powered by Southern Union State Community College, the venue at Five Points Farms and Boondocks Barbecue and Creamery. Dr. Don's weather is supported by the Randolph County Commission, Heron's Tree Service, Roger Bell Auto Brokers, Southern Auction Solutions, Genesis Weight Clinic, Jimmy Stevens Construction, Anchor Roofing, the Town of Wadley, Auction 431 South, and Bamadiesel Repair. Be sure to like us on Facebook, share us with all of your friends, and subscribe to Dr. Don's Weather on YouTube. We will be back tomorrow morning with another edition of your primetime forecast on Dr. Don's Weather.